I'm being thing. forcibly removed from the building again of a public lobby. So. so if you want to take off that gun and badge, I'm happy to scrap with you one day. Sir, please, is there anything I can do, sir, please? Don't do this to my wife, man. You don't know what you're doing to my family, man. Please, I'm begging. I'm literally begging. Where am I going to put my feet? Sir, I'm begging you, please. Please. You want to do it, You let's do it. Let me know, buddy. That is not a crime, and you're telling me to get out of my vehicle. Do you know where Lieutenant Mingus is right now? So, no, he's not in the building? I don't know. I'm not. What do you know? Okay, I don't want that man taking my picture. Uh, Why sir, don't you take him out of here? Sir, you hit me. I'm a you hit no. me. Okay, sir, okay now you take my picture, then. I don't know you. I'm not telling you nothing else until I find out who's driving that vehicle. You not a supervisor, bro. I need somebody higher than you right now. I didn't break the law. I'm not going to be found guilty of anything. This is a waste of time. If you guys want to know who I am, I'll tell you who I am. Okay. You want to know what I'm doing here? I'll tell you what I'm doing here. Uh, if you didn't know, I went to the police academy and they kicked me out. That's my purse! I don't know you! Spit me on my face right now! She spit in my face! Please, sir, please don't make me sleep in jail. I'm begging you. We're sir, not criminals! Please. They're going to make me sleep in jail. Why? Sir, please. Please, dude, please. Oh, my God, don't do that to him. You guys don't know what you're doing to me, man. Why? Why are you saying right here? Oh, man. You guys really don't know what you're doing to my life with this, man. Seriously, please. We really haven't been getting a lot of support from the community. Um, You know, we need help getting hotels. Uh, we've pretty much got the food and gas covered, but if there's any way anyone can help out in any way, guys, the hotels, uh, the fees have really been killing us. Um, you know, we don't make a, a million dollars. We don't make a whole lot of money. But if there's any way anyone can help out, please, we couldn't do it without you guys. Today's video takes us to River Oaks, Texas, where we find Harvey Freebird also known as Harvey Jailbird, and his good accomplice, Manuel Mata, which is Manny the Misfit, no doubt about it. Now, he uploaded this video once before, I'm talking about Harvey, and he wants to upload it again. So I said, well, you know what? I might as well get on the bandwagon and upload it again, too. What's good for the goose is good for the gander. At least mine will be a little bit different. His is exactly the same. Well, not to worry. Manual is arrested, and I don't care how many times we watch it. That's always a good thing. Sit back, watch, and <laughs> enjoy. Hey, it's not our problem. We're being super kind and saying no. You can, you can super kindly get sued. We're not interfering. Interfering is a physical activity, sir. Learn the law. It's Texas Penal Code 38.15. Yes, it is. Texas Penal Code 38.15 is interference. It is a physical activity. I have to come in between you and what you're doing. Yeah, this is the idiot behind the camera, Harvey Jailbird. Yeah, interference can be something else besides a physical thing. Yeah, because you know what? When you're trying to do something and you have somebody just running their mouth and you can't hear yourself think and the other person can't hear what you're saying, well, that's interference as well, you moron. But let's carry on. I already have two lawsuits over this penal code. Go ahead. We are plenty far away. We are not obstructing or interfering. City of Houston versus Hill says speech is not interference. Hey, don't answer any of his questions, man. 
Oh, Harvey Jailbird is a YouTube law expert in addition to his many other fine qualities. Now we're going to skip ahead just a bit here because you can't really hear what's going on in the background. It's Manuel running his fat mouth. Oh, and it's foul too. A fat foul mouth he has. So let's skip ahead just a bit till we get to the confrontational part, shall we? Five minutes later. Hey. What's your name and badge number? What did I do? I just unlocked my car. There are weapons That's in here. My car. No, sir. I'm asking. I'm not a threat to you. Do not put your Hey, man. You just assaulted him, man. I am my supervisor. We want your supervisor. Raise your hand again. Your supervisor now. You pussy. Call your. You put your Stay back from my car. Man, hey, you're out of control, man. He's I'm not going to tell you again. Hey, he's we're on a public right, right away, car. man. Stay right back. There. Stay back Put from my car. We're, we're on a public hey, right away, man. Call yeah, exactly. That's, I, I will. You just, assaulted, you just assaulted him, him sir. That's a free man. You just assaulted a free man. Shut up, There's been no crime committed. We're on a public right away. What really pisses me off about these idiots is they claim to be civil rights activists, freedom fighters, if you will, but they've never heard of the 13th Amendment that was ratified in 1865 and set all the slaves free in this country? You never heard of the 13th Amendment? Everybody in this country has been free since 1865. Oh, and what year is it? 2023. Let's see. What? 158 years? You bloody moron! Shut up. We're on a public right away. You can't be pushing people around. I, I, hey, let me borrow your gun for a few days. I asked you. Can I borrow your gun? I asked. Man, you guys got a lot to learn, man. That little six weeks in the academy didn't teach you guys much. Six weeks. One, three, eight, nine, seven, two, zero. River Oaks Police Department. I need you to identify, sir. We do not have an agreement to. Uh, are you? Asking You're a public to servant. It? It's your policies and procedures to identify when Both any member of the public asks you. It's in your policies and procedures book. I disagree there. Now you don't know what you're talking about. You're going to look real stupid on the internet. Cool. Yeah. I'm going to request your body camera because you just witnessed him assaulting. He just battered me. He told you to stand back. No, that's an unlawful, that's an unlawful order. order. Okay. Just yeah, because you say something doesn't make it law. Exactly. You right. guys have to follow the rules. Right. It's not a crime for us to walk next to his and car. You witnessed them, so that means you let him do it, so now you're part Sir. of it. What? Oh, Manny the Misfit's been arrested so many times, I don't think he even knows how many times. Yeah, look at him. I bet his mama's so proud of him. Her bouncing baby boy grew up to be a thug that hates cops. I don't know, man. I wonder if these guys ever call 911, you know, sitting around in the home late at night and they're hearing noise, somebody breaking in. Would they call the cops? You think they would? He said earlier, you point your I can point my, my finger all in your but face. But you're approaching me. I'm going to take I that can. as a threat. I can. You work for me. Mother. Hey, exactly. your paranoia is not our problem. That? What crime is that? What paranoia? Your paranoia. What crime is that? You think if somebody yeah, raises their right finger, you're taking it as a threat. That's not our problem. Which is my First Amendment right. In my eye. I'm not shining so? it in your eye. So, what crime is that? I'm trying to shine it at your name tag. You got your name tag covered up. Yeah, we're trying it. That's all. You, take it off. You want, that's what we're trying to see. You're, you're hiding it. You Why are you hiding your name tag? You are you embarrassed it. to be a police officer? Why are you hiding it? Yeah. This light is for citizen look, safety. Y'all see, see it? Look, he's hiding his badge number right there and his name tag. Look. Yeah. He's hiding his name tag and his badge number. You see that? Yeah. See that shit? What a coward. Oh, Harvey Jailbird took a ride once before for interference. Yeah, he said interference is a physical thing. And he took a ride. It was hilarious. Hey, we're going to skip ahead a little bit more because, you know, these riders have a lot of dead air. Soon after. Supervisor now, Tobar. I want your supervisor here now. You assaulted this man. Do you know what assault is? Yeah, what you just did to him. You just assaulted him. You just pushed him. You just assaulted him. Hands on me. 
That's what you did. You put your hands on me, bitch. That For no you, reason. That's literally all you have. My actions. To Get your supervisor here, Tobar. I respectfully declined your right. asking. And, and then when you when I walked up on you to tell you to step back because you were way too close. Exactly. Way too you close. You walked up on him, Tobar. Do this to you, pussy. Right. From where you're at, that's cool. That's the same From place where, that was no, at. Was it? Because you I, were, I could touch you. You walked up to me. I, because you were walking towards me. Exactly. But I you just walked up to me. Look how stupid you sound. I'm sorry. Yeah. Oh, and now he apologizes. No, no, we want your supervisor, Tobar. You may be wondering what all this back and forth arguing is all about. Well, it's only about one thing. It's the clicks and views on YouTube. Yeah, arguing makes for great content on YouTube because it shows the subscribers that these two yahoos are not afraid to stand up to the man and they don't take any mess. Now, we're going to skip forward until the next day when these two yahoos go to the police station to file a complaint. Roll that clip. The next day. Yeah, if we could talk to a uh, supervisor here, that would be great. Okay, in one moment, sir. The head person in charge. Thanks, man. Hey, you left your sunglasses right there. I gave them to, that, I gave them to him. Oh, what's your name, bud? My name is Hey, but you do have a warrant for your arrest. From where? From here. From where? From here. What are you talking about, bro? Like River Oaks PD. So you're under arrest right now. For you what? Have a warrant. We'll explain to you. For later. tickets? Yeah. For for a citation. For tickets. Yeah. For tickets. Wow. What? For interference. From where? River Oaks. This ain't tight. You're all right. You're all right. Ain't tight. From the other night? Uh, interference? Uh, I have no idea. That is not a, for a ticket. It's not a ticket. That's what he just said. We'll explain to you. Gra grab my phone, honey. You, you want to your phone with you? Huh? You want to finish filming that up, too? I mean, yeah. Yeah, we'll bring this. You want your phone with you? It doesn't make sense, bro. You want your phone with you or not? Your phone number. Yeah, give me my phone. That you notice how every time a frauditor is arrested, they're always thinking about their potato camera? They don't think about anything else except that stupid ass camera. Oh man, you should be worried about some other things, but the camera, that should be the last thing you should be thinking about, man. One that you have in your hand for you. You want it? Yeah, keep the other one. That's this is from the other night. Nah, I'm going to put it in your pocket. Oh, oh sir, you work there. What's your name and badge number? Listen. No, get his too. Badge number. Because what y'all are doing right now is illegal. You know that, right? That's all you need. That's no, I need your badge number. It's your policies and procedures to identify. No, it is. Name and no badge number, sir. Y'all don't get a second chance at this. One nine nine. He, that officer would not identify. He said Mesa. He didn't so give me his badge number. It's 215. So he pressed charges on me. I need to file a complaint on, uh, the, on an officer with badge number 204 assaulted him the other night. Is that what y'all are arresting him for? I'm assuming. I wasn't there, but I know it The officer assaulted him, and y'all are charging him with interference. I'll get you a complaint for him. You guys are ridiculous, man. Anything else? You guys are out of line, man. Well, there you have it, folks. An oldie but a goodie. Like I said, if he's going to re-upload, I'll re-upload too. At least my video is a little different than his original video. Yeah, but I tell you what, RV Jailbird, I can't wait to see you get arrested again. Or maybe a member of your posse like Cody Low Roller or Carolina the Crazy Woman. <laughs> yeah. Well, at any rate, if you enjoy watching idiots, imbeciles, and morons on my channel, please subscribe. <laughs> As always. Thanks so much for stopping by, sweethearts. Mm-hmm. Cheers to that, Harvey Jailbird. Oh, you assaulted me. I did. So you assaulted me. She assaulted me. Oh. Yo, you're racist. Katie. Racist. Oh. That's a hate crime. You're being disorderly. Call the police. Call the police. Call the police. I'm not sitting down. I refuse to sit down. I refuse. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. Big tough guy. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing. Nothing. You can come try to make me. You're welcome to try to make me. Take a swing. Take a swing. What is the reason for calling the officers here? You'll go to jail, bro. Go ahead, put Stop your hands on me. me bro. Put your hands on me. Really, no reason I'm really, to have I'm really, I'm really unhappy that somebody did this to me. I'm going to arrest you for trespassing yeah, in a minute. On um, public property? Yeah. We're asking you to leave and you're not leaving. That's trespassing. She's, she's right in my face, guys. You, you just assaulted me, man.
You can't t come up and touch me like that. You don't have permission to film me in any space. I don't need permission to, yes, to you record do. you in public, man. Actually, no, that's the law. Salami hala handula. Alu akbar. Haknuikan da kra. Ula wala fufatai.